Hello everyone, and welcome back to my XCOM Classic Iron Man campaign. Lucky episode 13, and I am pressing on. Uh, this episode is going to be longer than normal, because I am trying to get through to the end of the month. I feel the end of the month is going to be the most telling point of the survivability of this campaign. Get those three satellites up, and see where we stand with our nation's report and so forth. I've already gone ahead and looked over a couple of things that I think I should do. I want to build another power generator as soon as possible. So I am going to sell one of these power sources. I still need... I only have... I, I still have one for research. I only need one. For now. It would be useful in the long run, admittedly, but... I need to be able to expand to the next level as soon as possible, so I need to get a power generator up. And also, I saw that I could make a heavy laser. I'm researching the preci uh, precision lasers now. So there's not much else I can do there. Let's go ahead and give this to the heavy right away. I pretty much got a squad selected who's going to go out. It'll be uh, the sniper, the heavy, uh, these two assaults. And this support, and this rookie with a med kit. Because I have people injured, unfortunately. Sammy, Ryan, and John Tree all out for up to a week. Alright, well, I'm ready to run time and see what the first encounter is. Commander, we're detecting a new contact. Uh, much larger than anything we've previously encountered. Yeah, I'm gonna lose the I UK. We scramble our best equipped fighters if we're going to engage There's nothing that I ship. can do. It would have taken multiple interceptors, and I only have two at home. I would have had to have transferred them there, and I would have had to have known it was coming, so there's nothing I can really do about it. Getting some scientists in a bad idea, but can I afford three? It's a little more than I have. I got 20 days to worry about that. Let's press on. We haven't scrambled our fighters to intercept the latest UFO contact. Let's hope it doesn't do any serious damage. I will build a launch satellite soon. It should we'll help with some contact. of that. And, and the same thing again. Signal. Nothing I can do. Like it's scanning for something. Commander, we've just lost one of our satellites. We will now be unable to track any UFO contacts over that particular nation, and they've cut our funding as a result. I had been saying that that continent was lost to me. Commander, we're tracking several reported abductions via the hologram. Okay, four engineers, this is in my own in. continent of... A uh, chance that I could do something in the UK. I don't know if it would actually help. I've lost a couple nations there permanently. But it would be nice to have another sniper. Wow. Uh, I can't afford to lose South America at this point. That's the one I want to get next. So that's where we're going to go. And so actually, I do want to bring him along, but I'm going to have to go back to this guy and unequip him the good stuff to give to Ryan. Give him back to his basic gear. Carapace armor, laser rifle, and a med kit. And again, every time they die or you have to change their armor, it changes the look. I don't like that. So here's a pretty standard setup. Two assaults, two supports, sniper heavy. Heavy's got a laser gun now. Med kit, med kit, I guess we're good to go. Argentina next. The threat there seems to be the most pressing. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles.
in position on approach of the abduction site. Strike one is awaiting drop clearance. Copy that, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage hostile targets. Watch your backs out there, people. Okay, I'm a little familiar with this one. There's going to be aliens inside the bar and grill that are going to come crashing out at some point. Going to maneuver some people around. Get them into cover and uh, wait out the first turn and see what happens. Oops. Hate when you have to fight the uh, camera like that. It's finicky. Hope they improve that with the expansion. Okay, gonna put everyone in overwatch as usual. Those are floaters. I do need to capture some live aliens still, including a sectoid. I don't know if I'm gonna see any sectoids anymore. Put that off a little too long, I think. Let's run up and see if he triggers anything. No. Oh, there we go. Three mutons. Oh, these are kind of rocket shots you live for. Let's do that. Doesn't kill them all, but it's going to bring them all down to about four hit points. A little collateral damage, but what are you going to do? We're trying to save the Earth people. Huh, sniper should be able to finish this one off. Come on, Brandon. Ryan, 52% shot from there. Move you over here. I think you might just get him flanked. Yep. Oh. Had he already moved in that turn? I guess he had. Take a shot, Red. 52%. It's not very good, but... Amazing. Well done. Yeah, get away from that car. Better leave. I would like to move him up, but I need to be in overwatch in case he comes around the other side. Oh boy, floaters. Oh boy. So we still got one muton with four hit points, and now we got two groups of floaters, or two floaters. Alright, Ryan, take him down. Well done. No longer a threat. How about you, Red? Can you match him? Very nice. Now I'm gonna peek up and see if we see him. No. Let's throw a battle scanner up the street here. Up and running. Oh, the last one ran inside the building. Not really sure where he is. Moving to Overwatch. Moving to Overwatch. Better play it safe. Oh 
Okay, McNoobs, you haven't been out in a while. We're gonna send you forward, try to trigger anything. Nothing to be seen. Give him support cover. And start moving the heavy that way as well. I'm gonna leave these two here. And the sniper is definitely staying on Overwatch here for a little bit. Try to pick off. We gotta find that last muton and any other patrolling groups. Oh, Thin Men. Except I think they were a patrol and I think they took off. Keep moving up. Well, at this point, I think I need to approach the building. I'll send them all the way into the corner here, give them a good uh, view through the doors and the windows. Nothing to see. And that's what I thought. Red will just be able to just make it to the other side of the door, so we're ready to breach. Just keep overwatching with the sniper. Well, I think I'm going to send these guys up along the truck here and bring them around for a flank. Did not uncover them. At this point I'm going to move the sniper up. But well, I'm going to have to put him into pistol overwatch. Back to these two in a sec. Put them all in Overwatch. Well, let's kick the door in at least and see. Well, we know the Thin Men are out back. It's really not any good cover. Ooh, there's full cover there. Let's try this. What the hell was that? X-ray spotted. Well, we have finally uncovered the thin men. What the hell was that? Whoops. Kind of annoying how you have to click through. Oh, you got there's really no way to get through around here. I didn't know that. Hmm, decisions, decisions. There's just nowhere to go for good cover around here. It's really annoying. I guess I'm going to start moving him to be able to pop out this door to check the alley. Her to cover him. I've got to move them out of there and I'm not sure where to put them. The only other option I have is to come back where he is and approach this truck. Which is what I'm going to do with him. Yeah, I'll just start moving him back. Not sure what else I can do. I don't like this approach. There's not enough uh, time for them to make it to that full cover. Oops, I forgot to switch him out of the pistol. Still 
Alright, just get him. back to those. Let's take a look here. I think after all I am going to try something aggressive here. I'm going to run and gun up to here. I'll give him a chance to still take a shot or go into an overwatch position. There we go. Unfortunately he might get hit here. But when you're dashing it's less likely. Thankfully a big miss. Aye. That was a very aggressive move. Take him out. Oh, come on. Target's still up. Well, I just put him in a horrible position. Let's see what I can do to help out at all. She could throw smoke on him. She doesn't have very good shots. Let's try to protect him. I thought there would just be the one of one other thin man around that corner. It's really unfortunate. Got a chance for Brandon to take out one of the floaters at least. Very good. Alright, I think we're gonna start going up this back alley and try to flank him from behind. What kind of cover do we have out here? She's just dashing up right with him. Well, let's hope for the best. There's that last thin man. Oh, big hit. I'm all right. I'm all right. Okay, that could have went worse. Who's he have a shot on now? Yep, take the shot. We can get him out of the picture. He's got a great position up there. Excellent. So there's two or three floaters yet. I'm gonna take a look right now. I think I can get him up to the corner. I can probably get them both up. If I'm willing to leave him open a little bit after. Yeah, I'm gonna go up. I'm gonna try to take these guys all out. That'll work. And we'll bring Red up to the corner too. She can't see anything. Okay. Eighty-one percent chance. Very nice. Mission accomplished. All right. Panic all over my home continent. But I have satellites coming, as I said. Just going to quickly review what we got and uh, what we can do and just press on. Hopefully there will only be one more mission before the end of the month. Just picked up Will to Survive. Reduces all normal damage taken if, if in cover. Our new up-and-coming assault. I've said before I prefer aggression. And again here another obvious choice, move additional three tiles. And she is wounded, but we're gonna get some other people back. Remember, we will be watching.
It's a bit of a mess, I must admit. I don't need all of these anymore, as I was saying before. I'm pretty sure I just need four and three and four. I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. I've already put the new recruits to work in the lab. Okay, we're getting close to be able to get the laser sniper rifle. And we probably have soldiers who will be healing soon, so... Oh, and that's right. The reason I wanted that was because I wanted to build the access lift. So we can start working on the next level. Here comes our third satellite. Let's try to get the lasers if we can. Oops, we got some people back. Oh, he doesn't have the armor on, that's right. Well, we'll figure out who we're going to take when the next mission comes up, because it'll depend what kind of mission it is. Still trying to get these lasers, I have a feeling. Yes. Uh, at this point, I'm going to go for the skeleton suit because that's also a very nice bit of armor. All right, keep running time. Access lift operational. Seven days until the end of the month. Probably be another mission before then, though. Like right now. Commander, there's a priority one transmission coming in from the council. 112 bucks in panic reduction. Oh, bomb disposal. These type of missions can be annoying. We are confident that you will handle this matter with discretion. Usually the council missions just have a lot of thin men, so it's a good possible time here to bring along a rookie. But there is someone else who currently is wearing the good armor. There he is. Give this rookie the best fighting chance. So we still have our two assaults with arc throwers. I do need to try to capture some live aliens. Okay, I guess this is the best I'm going to be able to do. I don't think this will be too hard. You got to really move from bomb to bomb pretty quickly though. Touching down. Get ready to deploy. Our AO is within the continental United States. Strike one. Council intel indicates the aliens are charging a plasma bomb of some kind in your vicinity. Time is running short. We need to locate and disarm that weapon before they're able to finish priming it. Our sensor readings indicate that the device is some sort of priming mechanism. The aliens are transferring power from it directly to the bomb itself. Disabling this power node should give you more time to find and disarm the explosive. We have a new objective. Well, they pretty much explained it all there. You have to find each of these power nodes and disable them as quickly as possible. That keeps buying you more turns back. It seems you've bought yourself some time, but you still need well, to hurry. Your... Thank you. Well, you know.
Just trying to think about where I'm going to want to put everyone. This is the edge of the map over here, both sides, so it's a long, narrow passage up this direction. And I've kind of already started splitting up two and three, two and four. Okay, I'm going to put everyone in Overwatch. I need to find the next node as soon as possible. Ryan's got to move an extra three tiles thing. Ah, there's one there. He can actually dash all the way up to it. I'm not sure if working diagonally from it works or not. I'm pretty sure it does. I'm taking a big gamble here. Ah, and there's a couple more that direction. Good, so we're going to want to move up that way. Let's see here, we're gonna send this assault all the way up to here. As well as red, gotta be aggressive. We have to get to each of these power nodes. If we don't disable the bomb before it explodes, then we only have so many turns to be able to escape and it's very hard and I could lose I could lose everyone. He's going to stay back and guard that direction just for a little bit and can dash him up later. Roger. I've got my eyes on him. Oh, where's Ryan? It's not working. Have to be next to it. There we go. Good work. That'll buy us a little more time, but you still need to find that bomb. Well, I gotta be aggressive. Send red all the way up. She's in range to move on that one in the next turn. I'm send him all the way up to. There's no aliens currently active, so it's safe enough to be a little aggressive with my movement. Which side be? I'll be on this side. Next turn I'm gonna put him watching with the sniper rifle down that lane. He'll have good line of sight. I don't want to send him by himself this way, but I'm just curious to see if there was one over here. It doesn't look like it. Whoops. Let's get him as far up here safely as we can, and then the next turn. I feel, Commander. Okay, red. Move forward and disarm the next bomb or the uh, power you. node. Oh boy, a couple thin men. Ah, no, there's that ability she picked up where if an alien comes within four tiles of her, she gets a free reaction shot. I said it can really save their butts. She's still got a 62% chance on them from here. On the other one. It's not a great shot, but I was hoping to get lucky. Now, I know you can uh, activate these still even when they're out of points if you just click on the character. There we go. It still lets you do that. Good job, Strike One. That should buy us a few minutes. Now, where can I get Ryan in to finish this guy off cleanly? Inside the truck here, he'll have full cover. 65, not great. Give it a shot. Alright. I'm about to start keeping score.
keep on dashing. Son, the rookie all the way up. Gotta get him. Gotta get him involved for sure. Oh, there's another one up there. Oh, sniper had a shot. They're the only ones left. So he's gonna get a free shot on someone, unfortunately. Well, I can get him up on the roof here. Yeah, go here. Might be able to get a shot off from here if we can see him. Cannot, unfortunately. I'm gonna run out way out here and try to be able to spot him out and be a distraction if possible. Oh, now I can see him after all. Okay, I wonder what's up with that. The icon went away. Oh, because he probably was invisible. Uh, now he's uh, probably been spotted out and still couldn't finish him off. Good time to be able to capture one. If there's any chance to get close enough to him. I'd hoped he'd shoot at him, but I'd hope he'd miss. Oh man, big crit. But he's still alive. She can get up there and deliver. Let's give it a try. We're going to try to capture this guy. Should be good Good odds he's in a weak state. Get over there and deactivate it. Objectives updated. Say goodnight. Not so tough now. All right. We have captured the thin man. up, deactivate this node. Excellent. I apologize for the camera down. here again. It is very annoying. Hmm. I gotta get him down and healed, I guess. a job for Ryan. Look at this, he's going to go over the roof because that is, of course, the fastest route to reach him. I mean, I guess technically in terms of movement points it was. Okay, getting close, getting close. Rookie's gonna make a sacrifice. We're gonna charge him all the way in here so we can deactivate this node and hopefully he'll be safe. Why is he going through the roof? Deactivate this, so I gotta reselect him. Now, red. Zero energy on that power node she got a one. shot on him? No. I thought power she could. Deactivated. Take him out. I'm about to start keeping score. I need to heal him again. Come on, time to cowboy up. He's gonna be hurting for a long time. There's an upgrade I can do from the officer training school. I think if I can get all the way up here, uh, the upgrade I can do uh, half the time. It reduces the time of being healing after being injured by half. There's a bunch of other ones I can do, but they're very expensive. Uh, if I can finish this, that might be the end of it. Well done. Now you just need to eliminate any remaining hostiles. Oh, of course. 
Stay alert, Strike One. I think we want a sniper up on the roof. Your position. Objective updated. On Overwatch. Bring it on. Drop your over uh, Overwatch thin men. Well, well, what is this? Four of them? Five? Well, this just became fair for them. He's got no, no ability to shoot anything from there. They're all in Overwatch. I can't even see them. Uh, gotta try. Urgh. Damn it! Enemy is still alive. I'm going to have to force some of them to take their Overwatch shots. People like Red with lightning reflexes can do that easily. In fact, she can get right up here. I don't want to put her on the edge where she'll be attacked by the, uh, the uh, one on the ground. Get up here, get the shot, and finish him off. Under fire. This is a mess. Alright, looks good. Shoot in the face! You better take cover this direction. What about the rookie? Already used him. Could throw a battle scanner. I think I will send someone out to spot. I'm taking fire. Whew. Uh oh, Whoa. not gonna get lucky twice, right? Oh yeah! That was a gutsy move. Oh man, three. I thought he'd trigger one or two of them at most. Look how many there are, this is ridiculous. Ha! Most lucky maneuver ever. Oh, a rocket would not go amiss. I gotta get him up here into a better vantage point to try to do that. We also need to get him in a position to be able to take some shots. Not bad, not bad. Oh, big flank shot here. Oh, she gets her uh, reaction shot again. That is an amazing ability. Okay, can the sniper see anyone? Oh well, yeah, take him out. You get the best position to do it. This is going to look pretty ridiculous, though, I'm sure. <laughs> Whatever works. Oh, now we can't see him from there? That's pretty ridiculous. Take the shot. I think there might be one left. I'm 
I'm sending him down to get healed again. I'm not entirely sure if this is true, but I have read that if a soldier is healed in the battlefield, he's not going to have time to do it until the next turn, that their downtime is lessened. There's still one left somewhere. It's quite a mess up here. I'm not sure where the last one is. And loaded. Eyes on the field, Commander. Eyes on the prize. Guess we're about to find out. Quick heal. Come on. You'll be back in the fight ASAP. I do not see... Might be a case that I have to fight my way back to the landing zone. There might be some further back behind us. So actually, let's bring the sniper well back over here and see what he can see. Same with the heavy. They're in good positions on that. Oh, he was on the roof. I'm going to put him back up there. sign. Looks like I can drop him right down here and see what's up. Nothing to see. Is he going to be over here? Need to get to the rookie. Come on. It's very unintuitive as to which key, tab, or shift you need to hit. It's always like the next one you're gonna... you think it's the next one. Hmm. this last alien. Can't even hear anything. Guess we're going to have to check this building out. Because I don't know where else there could be. Ah, again, the camera can be quite annoying. Here's the landing zone. Come 
Come on, game. What, what's going on here? I don't see where else. Oh, there they are. It never gave me any sound cues. Guess I was just supposed to guess where they were. Now everyone's well out of position. Why are you going over the roof for this? Uh, I need to bring him back as well. Okay. Dude's doing some acrobatics. And another rookie kill. Yeah, of course he did, you know, the full nine points damage required to kill him. Oh, come on, stop fighting me. I'm charging in here to find this guy. And then I'm going to run and gun and take him out to avenge the rookie. Oh, they're both right here. Yikes. I thought one of them was off back. It's alright though, because it looks like I can get him, well, not into a great position, but he should be able to at least uh, have some shot at him. Alright, come on. 64%. Finish him off, you man. Of course not. I'm going to have to bring him down with a pistol and hope to finish him. Should be a flank shot. With a laser pistol, I believe it'll be possible to do four points damage. Three. He's the only one left and he's got no hope of getting in there. So all he can do is overwatch. Hope this guy doesn't take someone else with him. Wow, almost, almost. Wow, Red. Your chance to redeem yourself or to revenge. I'm gonna be sick. Well done, strike one. Oh boy. Okay, we are almost done. I will be able to run out to the end of the month at this point. Let's send up the last three satellites see where we stand. Mr. Scott promoted to Major. Additional inventory slot, that's always a nice one. Red also promoted. Extra conditioning. Gravely wounded, I know though. it wasn't easy, but this could really be a turning point in our research. Not only can we interrogate the subject, but bringing an alien back alive provides us with a much better understanding of their physiology. 
Impressive work indeed. Preparations in the containment facility are well underway. We will be in touch, Commander. We should begin interrogating the alien subject immediately. I'm confident we can safely house it within the containment facility, but I can't say for how long. Well, it is time to launch the satellites. It's just wasteful to use them in the UK. I can't save it. Thankfully, I brought South America from the brink. It'll be safe for sure through the next month. As long as I get more satellites built, I'll be able to grab it next month. I'd like to grab it now to get the We Have Ways so I could get through all my interrogations and stuff very quickly. But my home continent here is a mess. Uh, I'm feeling like I need to launch all three of them over the three in my own. I'm going to alert the staff as a precaution. Satellite launched. UK has lost me, but now I control my entire continent, and I'm going to go for South America next. So that's not too bad. And I can still launch one more, but I don't have one. I am making one more. We're very close to the end of the month, that's right. Satellite coverage now available in Australia. Oops, I didn't get it yet. Incoming transmission. Commander, regrettably. Some of our members have decided to withdraw from this council. That leaves us in oh, a we lost the entire of UK. Position. It'll this be okay. Not bode well for XCOM, Commander. These oh, it'll be okay. From the council are of serious concern. Well, now, I thought I had one more satellite acceptable. still. We expect more from you, Commander. We remain confident in your ability to improve the effectiveness of future XCOM operations. But this sentiment could change if your efforts continue to prove inadequate. Yes, yes. We will be watching. It's not great, but fortunately being able to reduce it to the least useful continent to me, maintaining my own continent and everything else being in such good shape, I really do believe that, believe that this game is still winnable. And there's a number of things I can do, but I think I will save that for the next video because this will already be pretty long. I have to decide how many satellites I can build, what new facilities. I'm going to run just a little bit of time to get those finished if I can. There we go. Because I am going to go ahead and get this one at least. I want to get to this steam as soon as possible. And then I want to build another satellite uplink here. That'll get me room for three more satellites, for example. And I already have room for one, so I could build four satellites. Just out of curiosity for how much they cost right now. I could afford that, and I could almost do that and build the uplink, so... Like I said, I'm going to want to take time to review it more carefully offline, not make any rush decisions. But I do believe this game is turning the corner back to winnable, so hope you're enjoying the series. I am going to continue it as soon as I can. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon.